Ghost Trick Yeti The Yeti, or Abominable Snowman, is an ape-like cryptid, taller than an average human that is said to inhabit the Himalayan region of Nepal or Tibet. The names Yeti and Mate are commonly used by the people indigenous to the region and are part of their history and mythology. Stories of the Yeti first emerged as a faucet of Western popular culture in the 19th century. The scientific community generally regards the Yeti as a legend, given the lack of conclusive evidence, but it remains one of the most famous creatures of cryptozoology, a pseudoscience involving the search for animals whose existence has not been proven. Western interest in the Yeti peaked dramatically in the 1950s. While attempting to scale Mount Everest in 1951, Eric Shipton took photographs of a number of large prints in the snow. These photos have been subject to intense scrutiny and debate. Some argue that they are best evidence of the Yeti's existence, while others contend that the prints are those of a mundane creature that have been distorted by the melting snow. The Yeti reached household name status through popular media's use of him as the snowy version of Bigfoot, with a notable showing of the abominable snowman in the classic cartoon Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Ghost Trick Yeti may be a male counterpart to Ghost Trick Yukiona. As in Japanese, the Yeti is called Yuki Otoko. Yuki means snow in Japanese, and Ona means woman. Otoko means man, so their names literally translate to snow woman and snow man. If you look closely, you can see that Yeti is holding the doll of Yukiona, and in the card artwork for Ghost Trick Break, you can see Yeti looking shocked at Yukiona making frost hearts on Ghost Trick Stein's back. Ghost Trick Mummy A mummy is a deceased human or animal whose skin and organs have been preserved by either intentional or accidental exposure to chemicals, extreme cold, very low humidity, or lack of air so that the recovered body does not decay further if kept in cool and dry conditions. Mummies of humans and other animals have been found on every continent, both as a result of natural preservation through unusual conditions and as cultural artifacts. Over one million animal mummies have been found in Egypt, many of which are cats. In addition to the well-known mummies of ancient Egypt, deliberate mummification was a feature of several ancient cultures in areas of South America and Asia, which have very dry climates. The oldest known deliberate mummy is a child, one of the Chinchoro mummies found in Caramones Valley, Chile, which dates around 5050 BCE. The oldest known naturally mummified human corpse is a severed head dated at 6,000 years old, found in 1936 in South America. Mummies are commonly featured in horror genres as undead creatures. One of the earliest examples of this is The Mummy, or A Tale of the 22nd Century, an 1827 novel written by Jane C. London. This early science fiction work features an Egyptian mummy named Cheops, who is brought back to life in the 22nd century. During the 20th century, horror films and other mass media popularized the notion of a curse associated with mummies. One of the earliest appearances was Jewel of Seven Stars, a horror novel by Bram Stoker, first published in 1903 that concerned an archaeologist's plot to revive an ancient Egyptian mummy. This book later served as a basis for the 1971 film Blood from the Mummy's Tomb. <laughs>